mentioned Hulk Hogan. I got to ask you. He's had a rough year. Uh, yeah, it's been a rough time, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, I, I sat here and talked to him uh, right when the big scandal happened a year ago, a year and a half ago. Uh, and then right maybe a month ago, you know, mm-hmm. uh, I reached out to him after the whole right, 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 right. audio tape comes out. Right. What did you, when you heard that, what was your reaction? Well, you reached out to him. Yeah. Right. So, I mean, what did you think? Um, I was surprised. Yeah. It's, um, it's the word, I think. That word is such a uh, such an ugly word. Yeah. Um, I think, though, once again, I'm nobody to judge. I've, I've Were you done, surprised, though? Uh, um, so yeah, surprise, absolutely, because Hulk's not like that, you know. But we all say things in stupid times and stupid ways. I'm sure you have. I'm sure I have. Yeah. Whether it be those type of comments or any type of comment that's not correct, that's not right. Yeah. But you know, um, I, I think I think it's one of those those deals where, um, you know, as a friend, you you got to stick by your friends in good times and bad times. And I don't condone it, and I'm surprised, but. A friend is a friend, so have you, you know, reached out? Have you spoken to him? Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, you know, I, I have, and uh, you know, I, I do feel bad for him. I feel bad for everyone involved. You know, I feel bad for people of color or of any type of race that that are fans of his. You know, you do feel a little bit let down, but I don't. I know this: nobody feels more let down than he does. Yeah. I think he feels really embarrassed and really bad about it. And um, you know, like I said, it, it's one of those things where I would never judge anybody, and I just feel bad uh, all across the board about it. This is Tony, Mr. USA Atlas. And I want to say, when I first started in the wrestling business, I said, Tony, if you have one friend, one friend, when you leave this business, consider yourself lucky. Well, I had several friends, and one of my most dear friends was Huck Hogan. And you know, all of us right now, we live in, uh, high on the hog, everybody making a lot of money because of the foundation that Huck Hogan laid for all of us. Huck is no racist, he's about one of the nicest, greatest people that I or you or American ever known or to me. Give the guy a break. Give him a chance. He's a good man.